Hey guys, this is Adam with Jackson 8 Company uh, telling you a little bit about lighting today. So, lighting is going to be kind of tricky for us because we're in these greenhouses and it lets through uh, a lot of light. But typically in, in most houses what they want to do is, is it's you know they're blocking out all the sunlight so they want to control that as much as possible. And uh, it really works out quite well to control it because a little fact actually is that greater than 50 lux, um, that's just one of the lighting terms that kind of says like what the intensity is at the at a certain point so what we're talking about is at the bird's height and where it receives that light um, the intensity at that so so 50 lux at that bird height and, and level uh, greater than that can actually cause like a, a barren or behaviors basically the the chicken doesn't act quite right it gets nervous and and um, can be, get kind of like aggressive and start pecking at other birds and stuff like that so we don't want that to happen um, but so that's that's why they most chicken houses are actually pretty dim just to, to keep those birds from from having those negative behaviors so um, what we've got going on though is we, we calculated it up on how those lucks are going to be we've got them spread out they're about 16 feet apart each of them and then just one string of lights down the middle and so uh, we, we needed to have that here in the barn so that we can actually kind of regulate their um, light how much light that they receive each day so that way even if the sun goes down then we can go ahead and give them artificial light and that by doing that then we can kind of um, regulate like when they how, how long that they will lay and uh, otherwise what we can end up with is every time that we go into the winter the daylight decreases and then uh, the birds can actually stop laying because that's what gives them a signal that they need to take a break but of course to be able to give you eggs year round we, we, uh, we kind of need to regulate when they take breaks and so we, we do give them breaks of course still but uh, we need to regulate when that happens so that's why we have the lights and, uh, and then some other interesting things is just how scientific and, and how particular that we can get about these things um, the warm lights which would be like a red dominant light spectrum that would be less than 3000 kelvins that's actually a lot better for uh, for for egg laying it produces it ups their, their egg production um, whereas a cool light so greater than 4000 kelvins that's a dominant blue spectrum that will actually improve like the pullet growth um, so it pullets you know the chick to where it's ready to lay um, so there's those kind of things that we can try to pay attention to and uh, and put in certain light bulbs just to, to help them out and, and make those chickens happy and you know that's one of those things like we're not really just necessarily trying to pump as much eggs as out as we can but uh, but it improves the efficiency and quite frankly if the the chicken is able to produce more eggs then that means that that chicken is more comfortable and uh, and happier otherwise it wouldn't be producing more eggs that's that's just uh, re reducing its stress environment and that's what allows it to to produce and, and do even better so uh, that's some details about lighting and what we're what we're trying to do to make our chickens as happy as possible so thanks for watching and be sure to like us on facebook or youtube and uh and keep following if you're interested in this kind of stuff and check out our jackson egg company eggs at deerbergs and food giant and schnooks and wherever else thanks for watching